I'm just tap tap and we're having a weird dream again. So yesterday we stole a creepy head thing. Oh, I don't have my things. Are my legs disconnected? No, I just jump really high. And I have, I guess those are socks. Yeah. I thought my legs were like disconnected from my body, but no. Oh, I saw a spooky light. What's with the super Oh! Mr. Ghost Man! With the Mr. Ghost Violin Man. Spooky. Good old spooky violins. Spookalins. Aw, oh, creepy murder birds. Those are always nice. Do I triple jump even- Aw, oh, I do! You triple jump even in, like, space. Hey. Hey, lady. Hey, lady. Where are we going? Where are we going? Let's go to space. Mr. Light Man. Oh, Mr. Tuba Man! Oh, he looks like freaking. He looks like that. The Psycho Bear. From, um. From, um. The Thing. Uh, Happy Tree Friends! Good old moon in the background. I don't know who that is. It's got a, like, military helmet. Oh, this is the next ghost. What 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 species of ghost? Oh, it's a saxophone ghost. Saxophone bird ghost. The rarest and most powerful kind. It powers damp towel man. What accordion? Accordion gator. Well, we lit all of the things. All right, what's this? No, jump down. Dig up, stupid. We lit all of the sigils. The ritual is complete. Oh no. What is that? Oh, it's a bear! Uh oh. And my face is gone. I just. My face has been dissolved. Okay. The controller was. was some pretty intense vibrations there. Ugh, neck. Neck. You know that thing where your neck wants to crick, but it doesn't crick? I hate that thing. Wake your butt up. Oh wait, probably nothing to see here. Oh wait, what's up, Greg? Morning! I'm somehow even more sore. This is bullshit. I'm working today. Angus is out of town and I'm lonely. Okay, bye. Sincerely, Gregory. Thanks, Greg. Let's see what's different today, I guess. I'm not really sure what the deal is. Why did Dad was supposed to move the thing? I'm offended, Dad. You have upset me for the last time. Sup, Mom? Good morning, did you feel it last night? No? What? There was a big sinkhole two streets over. Oh, dang. Oh, we still getting those? I don't think those ever really go away. Swampy ground and so forth, not a floodplain. Oh, weird. I don't want you over there nosing around it. I guarantee you I won't. I've seen sinkholes. No interest at all? Mom, there's just a hole in the ground. Get back to me when like swallows a house or something. Well, we'll go see together if that happens. Deal. So what did you do last night? Hung out with Greg. What'd you do? Uh, went to the grocery store. That sounds exciting. You get anything special? Hoo boy, sure did. Well, stop by the church if you're in the area. Will do, Mom. See ya. Hmm. <laughs> Bye, sweetie. Let's go see Greggy Boy is doing. Well, I guess we should look for the pothole too. That sinkhole. Whoa! Weather! Oh, I like this nice, some nice ambiance here. The trees, the pants were dead. I guess the pants were already dead. Never mind. And the sun was almost down from the top of the sky. People haven't seen that. Again, I do not know what the hell I'm talking about. But it's okay. You don't have to get every joke. It's fine. May Borowski, Silmers. Now, we all know how important it is to look our best. What? Our appearance is the first and sometimes last impression we make. Selmers, did you join a cult? Lucky for you, I happen to be a licensed dealer. Oh, okay. 
of the Salium family of products. Selmers, I don't have any money. Oh, okay. Are you giving that pitch to everyone? It's horrible, isn't it? I did a video seminar, and that's what the woman said. Did she sell anything? Yeah, her neighbor was really appreciative. Sorry. Everyone was smiling, and they just kept laughing. Just laughing and smiling. Look at the hand lotions. We can just smile and laugh if you want. Nah. Want to hear a poem? Oh, no. 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 Nah. I'm good. I'm good. Cool. I'm good, fam. I don't like poems. Especially not intentionally bad ones. My cat doesn't like the folks on the porch. Well, I'm a cat. Screw you. You can't trample my freedoms. Oh, we got little pumpkins! Jack-o'-lanterns! Things. Excellent. Where is this pothole? I need to see it. Sinkhole. Whatever. I hate that raccoon. Mrs. Wolf and Mr. Owlface. Let's go see B, I guess. Did he quit already? Hey, baby. Hey, May. How's it going? Got a lot of rocks all to move. Came in early this year. Like a crap load of snow shovels. Usually a distro place doesn't goof up like this. Maybe it's run by weather wizards? Yeah, that's not a bad theory. So what's up? Wanna hang out tonight? Uh, I'm working. If you wanna, like, come along. I was thinking we'd go play putt-putt out in Hunwick. May, that's actually not a bad idea, but sorry, I got work. Aw, oh, jeez, what even is the point? Paychecks, rent, food, medicine, that kind of thing. So you want to call along or not? Uh... Sure, let's hang out. We hang out with Greg yesterday. House call! So, do we... I guess there's different things we can do? I don't get it. Couldn't you just, like, refuse to do a house call? Uh, uh, that's me. Nope. Why? It's called a job. People pay you to do it. Ideally, at least. You come in. There's a thing back here by the driveway. Yeah, she's an old lady. She's got weird shit in her yard. It's like a windmill. Yep. I've never been back here before. May Borowski, you now have been here. It's nice. Yeah, it's just a bunch of old cabins people turn into houses. Some hunting camps. It's not like get shot or anything. Buck season isn't for a few days, right? Yeah. Folks getting pie shot. For murder. I didn't murder if it's animals. That's dark. Hold that thought. You get a knock? Thank you for coming on such short notice. No problem. I can sleep through a four alarm fire with that four furnace. We'll take a look at it. Ever since Jean passed, I just can't abide with that thumping. Understandable. Jean was such a darling man. Hey, what do you mean by hold that thought? Wait for it. I'll never forgive them for taking away. Oh, f you gotta be kidding. Ain't like I didn't treat him right. I looked him up on the internet. He didn't smell or nothing. Wait for it. You can't take a woman's husband just because he's dead. Oh, uh, no. Oh, no. Holy God! Took him right off that couch! It's a crime. Yeah, crime was definitely committed, alright. Yeah, that is. They just don't like being able to. By just not being able to tax him anymore, that's what that is. And I won't talk your ears off about it. Ugh. Well, come look at my fridge while you're here. We build by the half hour. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. Uh, do you got any bleach under the. Uh, uh, it, oh, thank you. Here, where's the bleach? Yeah, it's a nice fridge. What's the problem? Oh, there's no problem. It's just a classic, an original Luna Freeze. Wow. They were all the rage when I was your age. So, like, two centuries ago? They last forever. They make me feel so young. I saw these the other night when I was back into town. Oh, really? Where? Upside down in the logs in the ravine. She's offended. So, for us. Oh yes, go right through to the basement. You better not have any dead bodies in there. I'm not even getting paid for this at all, let alone for dead body insurance. Is dead body insurance a thing? It should be. All right, I'll be down here for a bit. Please remember not to lock us in. What? Last time we sent someone, he got locked in the basement. I assure you that did not happen. 
Is she trying to kill us? Ah, uh, he called me from your basement. Your man did smell a bit of booze when he came by. Oh, okay. Busted. Or something. Okay, down we go. It was nice meeting you. I don't really know who you are, little person. <laughs> polite. Very polite. The dead body lady is very polite. Oh, fuck. That's creepy. Man, I love creepy basements. Why wouldn't you? This is a freaking huge basement, by the way. It is like four times my height. Look at all of this splendor. Jeez, she's got a lot of junk. That, that statue creeps me out at the far right. Maybe she's got a few more husbands stacked in the corner. <laughs> Alright, let's get this done so we can go home. I need this. No, I need this. You don't understand. My people. It's very important to my people. Oh, I did the thing. I don't think you can actually get that. That's the furnace. That's the furnace. It has a face! I've decided his name is Clanky. Okay. You just hang out. I'm gonna fix this real quick. Don't like break anything. What am I gonna break? This is a basement full of crap. Oh jeez, okay. I shouldn't be long. Can I help? Nope. Why am I here then? Because you wanted to come along. Just chill. Alright, so freaking dead body lady. Oh, we can get this. Fish, fish, fish. Yes. Oh, let me grab it. I can't grab it. A bat! Hell yeah! Now give me the bat. Give me the bat, Marge. Give me the bat! Give me the bat! Boop, 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 boop. Professor Lucius Von Nomeo. Oh yeah, taking him around for that achievement sure was a pain. Why can't I take the bat? Just, just let me get the bat. Hmm. Badminton. Badminton. Mitten. Racket. Okay. Jeez, this is one old ass fan. It's made of metal and you can chop your finger off. Ugh. I bet I can make something out of all this junk. Jeez, who would even have this much junk? It's not that much junk! It's five items worth of junk! That is not that much! I think I could see this being useful in furnace fixing. I, I, I'm, am I making a device out of the junk to fix the furnace? This looks useful. What are you doing, May? And why am I helping you? I need your expertise to fix this stupid furnace. Now get the bat! Get the bat! We can fix the back of somebody's skull with that. Alright, so can't carry anything else. So I'm gonna say this is enough stuff. So, got a gnome, fishing pole, a badminton racket, and a fan. Got two wheels and a turning thing with no wheel. Probably just need to turn the turning thing. To open up the heat pipes. Clanky's probably got lots of heat, but can't let it out. To get Clanky all hot and bothered. We will teach Clanky to love. I bet I could. Hmm. I think Nomi could bite into the turny wheel thing where the wheel was. Use racket as a handle. Yeah, racket. That could work. Although we're not always going to be here to pull it. Uh, the fan could stay on. Then this, if this breaks, you only have to replace the fan. Should be good for the environment, too. That's important. Yeah, leaving a fan... On, constantly on, like the the mountain turbines on the fort thingy. God, I remember when everyone was so mad about that. It's gonna ruin the view. It's gonna kill birds. You know what else is gonna review ruin the view in birds when a meteor hits the earth because it gets too hot? That's what happened to the dinosaurs. Okay, where was I? Dinosaurs are effing rad. Yes, that was that's where I was. They had dinosaurs in the ocean too. Those were the coolest dinosaurs. I'm glad I wasn't a fish back then. Did they have fish or were they like dinosaur fish? No, fish are myth, may get a grip. I mean, they'd have to be dinosaur fish, right? I mean, like, colacants or coelacanths, how would you say that? They remember when back then they had dinosaur bugs, dinosaur trees, dinosaur poop. I'd like to see a dinosaur moose. I bet that would have been pretty great. Okay, focus, May. Now, mammals were small, unfortunately. But but, but we survived, so that was, that's what's important. Making a turbine. So, there's not a lot of wind down here, but like, okay, we stick Nomi in the ground. Sorry, Nomi. Put the fan on top of his flat table butt. I feel that pain, Nomi. I had one too. And tie the racket on like this. We just Rube Goldberg it up. Nomi was definitely blue before. Now he's red. I don't know how to feel about this. Sorry, I'm yawning. I should like start a company. Sustainable garbage turbine. Okay, done. What? 
think I fixed it. Now let's see what they got here. Yeah, we did. We? What did you do? I engineered an elegant long-term solution. Nope. God damn it. What are we gonna do, May? Don't fi please. Don't Way to go, May. Please don't fix anything ever again. Like, don't even have it, Pat. Anything you have to maintain. Aw, oh, freaking crap. It was totally gonna work. This is so typical. I'm gonna check the exit. We're locked in. Calling it. Oh, no, we're not. Damn it. Oh, we are locked in. Well, we're locked in. Ugh, oh, I knew this was gonna happen. Stupid, stupid bee. We can cut a hole in the floor. With what? Maybe she has an old saw down here. We're gonna what? Build a heap of garbage to stand on and saw a circle on the floor like a cartoon? Yes! Exactly! Maybe not with that attitude. But this knob is really old and loose. Maybe we can, like, figure this out. I'll look around, too. Yeah, you go around. Look around a whole bunch. We gotta use the bat, Marge. Use the bat. Oh, come on. I can't even use the bat. Mr. Clanky. The one thing she can't hear is this furnace. When it was broken. Broken things need to be broken. Oh, yes. We're gonna break it with a bat. We're gonna break her furnace to fix her furnace. You know, you gotta tear off the band-aid. A tool for beating ass. She hasn't she has a thing for ass. Ooh, look at her! She's ready to go. Aw oh, the music. Aw oh, hell yeah. Turn that up. Uh oh. <laughs> Sucky piece of crap furnace. Wow, that is pretty loud. Yeah, geez. Surprised I can't hear that back in town. Okay, she's coming, thank god. Uh, thank me more like? Hey, Miss Miranda, you locked us in. Well, that was fun. Uh-huh. You alright? She gave us lemonade! Yeah. You know, like lemonade? It's such a nice night out. Yeah, it's a nice night out. Lovely. Then what's up? Nothing. Just tired. Worked all day. I'm all hyper! Good for you. Ugh, you're zero fun. Yup. You need, like... Some magical shit to like give you a new perspective. Let me know when that happens. Would want to miss it. Are we just gonna go? Well, we didn't die, so could be worse. Could be worse. Join me on my journey, fireflies. Why do? You, why does she have a windmill? Holy shit! She has a freaking climbable windmill. Yes, yes. Come to me, fireflies. Thank you. Yes. Join me. Join me in my journey. Whee! I need to collect all the fireflies. No. Oh, that's not a collectible one. Okay. Well. I guess we're just going home? Wait, what? May, don't be a slacker. I may B. Wow. Haha. <laughs> Are you like a firefly whisperer or something? They just like me, I guess. That's you're an interesting person, May Borowski. No, Miss Miranda is an interesting person. Uh granddad said being interesting is lucky enough to be. I guess let's go for that. She like mummified a dude. Okay. You're more benign interesting. Woohoo! Did the fireflies work? You know, I have to say, this would have been a much less exciting evening if you weren't along for the ride. See? I'm good to have around. You can certainly beat the shit out of a furnace. I can beat the shit out of anything. Now that's the attitude to have right there, my friends. Don't let anything get in your way. You can beat, you can beat the shit out of anything you want to. Dream big. You should, like, channel that aggression you always have into something useful. Dr. Hank said way back I need to repress it. Repress? Not like learn to deal with it? He specifically said repress! 
I don't think that's how you do that. Uh, okay. Hmm. Do you think Miss Miranda, like, pulled her husband's guts out? Isn't that what you do for mummies? I don't know, my. Do you think you'd have the stomach for it? No. Nope. I probably took a lot. Probably took a lot of heart. Yep. I wish you would explain it to us. I get it, May. She really wrecked him. <laughs> okay, that probably stayed in place. Yeah, it should stay where it belongs. I hate you, May. I'm leaving. <laughs> hey, you gotta live her life. Bye. This is me gone. Hey, wait up. You're walking back to town. You got a lot of gall to say that. I'm calling the cops. <laughs> <sighs> that's how you that's how you enjoy your night, my friends. You find an old lady that like kept her husband's corpse in her bedroom and you beat the shit out of the furnace. And then you make puns. That's what you do. That's how you live it up. You know, better than the glass factory, is it? I've mined, I've ran machines, but now I get to slice steaks and hook salamis. I mean it's easier on the back, that's for sure. But like do you like it? I like having a paycheck. Fair. Paychecks, the sweetest meats of all. Okay. What'd you do tonight? Oh, you know, stuff. I'm tired. I feel like I just did a day's work. You know, there are places where you can get paid for work these days. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, they call it working. Huh. You kids with your slang. Slang you could pick up at work. Okay, yes, point made. Um, what about these boxes I asked about in the crawl space? Hmm, I'm thinking about it. Watch some TV with me. Uh, sure. Perfect timing. Garbo and Molay is starting. Ah, oh, yes. Just, I think she's supposed to be looking at the TV, but it just looks like she's rolling her eyes like, oh, this garbage again. Ah, oh, yes. You know what I like to get political here? Gotta do it. Gotta. You know, you hear about the snow and long on the books? Pirating a movie online, you know about that? I do. Punishable by up to 10 years in prison. Wow. And here I've been trying to get in the hard way. He has, folks. Wonder if a pirate movie about first degree murder earns you more prison respect than one about grand larceny? Hey, Malloy, you know what I think about that law? What, Garbo? That's a WAPA. I don't think that's. I don't, I don't think that's a joke. Coming up next, stupid sandwiches. Uh, their voices swapped again. Every time they fail to make a joke, their voices swap. It's how it works. It's canon. Don't, don't, it's the, it's the extended universe. Clearly, you did not read the books, you frickin' plebeian. How dare you? You don't know the Garbo and Molloy lore. You don't understand things. How dare you pretend to know things? Okay, he's not gonna move the things. I bet there's, like, evil spirits in there. Secret final boss. Speaking of secret final boss, why is, like, the frickin' Cheeto Bandito here with his rapier? I know I pointed out before, but still. Like, what's happening here? And there's like an old Revolutionary War guy with a musket. Oh, and there's this, like, the, the, there's the scream, like, right above me with, like, albino eyes. Huh. Well, it's bedtime again. Let's see if, let's see if we got any instant messages. Hey, that was fun. Let's do that again sometime. You're pretty handy when it comes to breaking stuff. I'm sure there's a job there somewhere. Yeah, it's called demolition. You can actually get a job doing that. Holy shit, I found my calling. I'm glad I could help facilitate this. Also, I looked up people who attract insects. You seem to come to a lot of heat and various odors. They can't get enough of this. I guess not. Good night, May. Night. <laughs> various odors. My odors are various, you could say. Hey, punk, what did you do tonight? Or got trapped in a basement, beat up a furnace. Right on, man. Right, night, night. I wonder if there's like a set amount of things. Like, I'm wondering if there's like a um a Greg path, and like there's missable Greg content, or like if there's just a bunch of different stuff, and you ha you eventually do it all of it. Because I don't want to miss out on, on any Greg content. You know, I pre-ordered to get the Greg DLC. You see. Well, that was this day. That was some fun with B. Tomorrow, we're, I don't know. We, we need a job at some point, but I don't know if we're going to do that tomorrow. But we're going to do things. Oh, dreams. Stay tuned next time for dreams.